it's distorting my vi oh oh cogs cogs cog robots take that bastard oh my god i am the strongest man alive i just one tapped that dirty robot What is going on, Nerd Paraders? Welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for coming to us today as we play a new game that came across my radar. I'm pretty excited for it. It is not absolutely brand new, but there is a new feature out about the game. And it's this right here. Co-op mode is live. This is Vulcanoids is what we're playing. And it is a steampunky-esque survival game. Something that you've come to know and love on the Nerd Parade channel. And I'm very excited to be able to play it here with you today. And we're joined with mine, who's going to be co-oping with me along the way. I am Nick, this is Nerdprint, guys. Welcome to the channel, thank you so much for coming to hang as we start a brand new game. Uh, we can do single player, multiplayer, friends multiplayer, and custom multiplayer. I'm gonna try custom, oh. Okay, it's just like creating a password, we'll try friends. And easy, normal, hard, or custom. Let's go to custom and see what we can change here. Uh, eruption frequency, which I would assume is the time in which the volcano erupts so do you want to give it 25 minutes or 30 minutes if the default is 25 what do you think mine well default okay I, I was gonna bump it to 30 but we'll leave it at the 25 uh leave that at 100 100 deposit richness this is the no richness of nodes we'll bump that up to about 300 percent because it's supposed to be get even be e it, we can't we can't bump it up well 250 <laughs> It refuses to be even. Okay, there we go. It refuses to be even. Therefore, my OCD says never. Harder cog drill ships in caves. Uh, we'll just we'll just roll with this. Adrenos used to be a wondrous. Adrenos place. used to be a, a wondrous rich, place. Prosperous island. A rich, prosperous home island, home to a busy port. trading port. But that, but that was not meant to last. last. It began when strange formations. It began when strange formations like giant soil tracks started to, started to appear across the island. island. No one was able to explain how they were made. They were made. How did these soil tracks Soon appear? After the formations appeared, Soon after the formation appeared, earthquakes followed. Weak at first, they grew more frequent and more violent. And more violent. I know he's narrating it, but I'm blocking it, so I'm narrating it too. Suck it. A few days later, three volcanoes erupted in the island lagoon, hurtling stones. Oh, crap, I missed it. <laughs> Captains feared for the safety of their vessels. All trade stopped. People left Adrenos aboard fleeing ships. The brave few who had remained soon regretted their decision. An enormous volcano lay dormant for centuries, erupted, flooding the island with pyroclastic wave. With a pyroclastic wave. Covering it with lava and hurling stones miles away. Those who had made it to the ships were evacuated, myself among them. What was left behind was an apocalyptic land of fire and dust. Periodic eruptions turned our beautiful home into a hellish nightmare. Disrupting, disrupting both naval and aerial traffic for years, despite their best efforts, not even the best imperial geologists were able to explain the volcano's sudden appearance. Several years later, exiles from Andranos secured funding for an expedition to return to the island and discover what had happened. It was my honor to serve as the captain of the Archimedes submarine. As we surfaced a safe distance from the Andronos shore, we knew that this expedition to reclaim our homeland had only just only just begun to live. I, I think it, I think I killed it with my singing. <laughs> <laughs> that was the end of the narration. So the volcano has been dormant for a little while. It appears that Andronos is no longer a Wretched Hive of Scum and Villainy. The uh, island is somewhat semi-prosperous here. We've got some machines, some numbers. Let's go down to the port here. Can I? It's not that. Oh, it's E. Okay. We've got some beds. You are now sleeping in a bed. Your inventory is saved. You'll be... Oh, this is log out? No, I'm going to continue playing. We just started. Okay, so you could just come into the beds of the submarine and log out. Oh. Um. Inter oh, I've got four medical... No, I've got a medical patch. Oh, you could, like, store... I think you store stuff here. Can you join the game? Is it letting you? It says loading 1% so far. Oh, okay, good. I'm going to talk to Captain. 
Craft drill ship cores. I will accept your quest, good sir. Good day, sailor cogs. Mysterious robots, and I don't know why I'm talking cockney. Uh, robots that took over our island possess technology superior to ours. Oh, so robots have now invaded. It is clear our first step must be to reverse engineer their tech to increase our odds. Find pieces of their technology and research them so they may learn how to capture their drill ships. Massive machines they are they use for transportation. We shall accept this quest from Captain Ahab, which is not appropriately named because he already gave us our name. Oh, mine's- did you just shoot at me? Inside of this submarine- your pistol's out. Okay, ow. That is a weak pistol. It barely took any life points away from me. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Do you have infinite ammo with that thing? Okay, all right. Clearly we can't have nice things. I missed- well, stop putting holes in my ship! Okay, this is why we can't have nice things. We immediately start firing our infinite ammo pistols as soon as mine comes into the game. This the yeah, pistol see, the friendly fire is the first thing you gotta check. Oh, okay, it's on. It's extremely ineffective, but it is on. It could pick that pickaxe, but <laughs> that was actually more effective. Is it more effective than? Oh my god! Oh my god! The pickaxes. More. Bullets are. I'm impervious to bullets. Pickaxes, however, are my greatest weakness. So we picked up our pickaxe. We need to mine some copper ore, which is green. Mine some coal, and scavenge destroyed production modules, uh, in order to craft a drill ship core, which would allow us to do something on the island. And it looks like this place is occupied. It's very steampunky. I love it. There's some coal here. And we should have pretty we should have rich ores. We should have plenty of stuff. Oh, I could heal, maybe. I'm just looking at it. Or no, am I eating it? Are they healing pills? Oh no, I'm I'm fully healed. It appears that at this stage of the game our resources, including bullets, appear to be unlimited. I enjoy it. It allows me to abuse the fact that I my revolver, which normally only shoots six shots, can now pulverize mine for basically no damage whatsoever. I don't know what I was expecting. Ow, you suck. Or are these just like scrap parts? Looks like it. Okay, that didn't advance. Oh, we have a we have a HUD indicator. Three hundred yeah, meters go this way. way. Go to a destroyed module. Defend against cogs if necessary. Okay, we got our revolver. <laughs> Although the pick seems more effective, we're going to bring out our revolver. And see what... Where, where did it go? We had it. For a second. Are we at the spot? Wait, no, it's just... Aha! I just had to equip the pickaxe. Screw the revolver. It doesn't tell me where to go. The pickaxe has magical radar in it, though. Maybe it's made with a magnetic tip that draws me to my destination? I'm going to go with that. We're going to go with the magnetic tip. Oh. Oh. Lava. The floor is lava mine. Don't step in it. I'm gonna jump in. Okay, see if it, see if you take damage from the lava. Ow, stop that. You, you Oh my It's distorting my Oh oh Cogs! Cogs! Cog robots, take that bastard! Oh my god, I am the strongest man alive. I just one tapped that dirty robot. You're adding insult to injury. Are you harvesting him? Taking them apart, looks like. I'll teach oh, you no, to pick up something. Screw you, Doctor Wily. We're on the side of Doctor Light and Mega Man. Okay, we we took them apart. Are you are you actually collecting? I'm not collecting. I'm just knock. I'm I'm whacking his. <laughs> Bite my shiny metal ass! No, I'm whacking. You bending him? Wait, what? Yeah, I'm I'm bendering. Bender bending Rodriguezing him. Rodriguez. I don't think I'm getting anything from that guy. But the pick is the mightiest weapon known to man. Much stronger than the puny pistol pea shooter. Yeah. Uh. Oh, just loot him! Dude, we're sitting here whacking them and they had stuff in their inventories their entire time. We just had to loot him. <laughs> Whoops. Literally had to press the one interact button and take what he had in his, in his robot compartment. Like Bender. Bending Rodriguez. My homie. Now what are you... Oh my, I don't understand how I put Where that in my pocket. You put that? that thing is gigantic. My prison pocket cannot, po oh, nor my backpack can possibly hold this thing. But as we can see, this is a world filled with robots, magical pickaxes, and 
very puny bullets, so we shouldn't question the logic of these. We're gonna chase- look at this guy's running! We're gonna chase you bastards down. My next option is unequip the pickaxe. That's- that's- that's my next quest. Put away your pickaxe. Never! It's the strongest weapon. Bullet. You- Yeah! Take that, robot scum! Oh, I'm hurt. You- did you say you ran out of bullets? No, no freaking way. This guy has bullets too. <laughs> oh. I'll show you when we kill this guy, and then I'll tell you. Okay. Alright, look, look at the back way backpack. Back way backpack on your. Oh, yeah, yeah, I uploaded my thing! A thing a thing! Yeah, I, I can see yours on there. You can see mine? Wow! Yes, it's NPG. That's awesome! We got robots destroyed, 4 out of 10. Yeah, I uploaded my thing a thing, and I thought it was really cool, so I. I, I really oh my god I'm gonna die. Gonna be official nerd break video in about 0 0.01 seconds. A bottom right shows your quantities, by the way. You only have a certain amount of those. Oh, I see three. Three. Oh, okay. The previous, the previous assumption that we have infinite bullets is incorrect. We have infinite pickaxe. We do not have There's infinite so bullets. Many robots. They're everywhere. Let's go back to the ship. I know. Let's Why are they? Too. Oh, unequip my pickaxe. Use submarine systems for production. All right, so the submarine is obviously our base of operations. We're going to take these resources that we just claimed back there. And as I'm noticing, we are in very close range to a volcano eruption. Oh, mine, do you want to test this for science? Um, if the floor is lava and it instantly kills you. Where are you? I'm right next to the floor that is potentially lava. Did you just... Instant, I heard thunk. Oh god! Oh god! No! Not me too! Not me too! You lose your inventory, by the way. I lost everything, including my pistol. I, sl I slipped on the edge. I didn't mean to jump in. I tried to like. Uh... We have to go scavenge again. No, no, it should it should be fine. It should be fine. I our backpack was there. Okay. But we should be able to go and loot it. This was for science. This was for science. I'm making a note. Huge success. We jumped in lava. And we immediately died from it, so we're probably not going to do that again. But it was fun and hilarious. And for science, you can get away with almost, almost anything with a proper excuse. And our mission of cooking ourselves alive was clearly justifiable because it was full of science. We are men of science. Whether it be steampunk science, space science, dinosaur science, or any other type of science, we are men of it. Yeah, that's right. Let's see if we can find mine's backpack. Now all the freaking turds have respawned. Okay, I see. Backpack, backpack. Uh, that's, that's my backpack. backpack. You get away. You get away from my backpack. I'm surprised that the lava instantly burns me but not my pack pack. Oh, Jesus. No, no, pack pack! No, no, pack pack! No! <laughs> How are we gonna get to pack pack? Oh, I don't hey. I think we're getting back No, back. no, we could get pack pack. I believe. You I believe. We got five minutes for interruption, right? It's. I do see that. It's four minutes and 45 seconds. If yeah, you're gonna I'll be a man of science. While you grab yours. You got. Oh, can we do that? Can we, can we form the human chain? To don't know. get all the stuff that... Wait, what does my wrench do? No item available. Maybe the quests will guide us. Once we get our pack packs back. <laughs> Getting them back. We're gonna get them back. We're gonna get... No, we're gonna get pack pack. We're gonna form... Wait. Can we use old pack packs as perhaps a... Jumping off point. Can we use robots? Yeah. That's right. Suck it, Dr. Wily. Can we use pack packs as no, a backpack. standing point? There are several pack packs there. This is my pack pack. You get away. Can I crouch? No, 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 no. It's gone forever. Look, there's more backpacks. It's gone forever. We... Dude, it it's gonna make me slip every time. The terrain is treacherous. 
Very, very treacherous. This, this, it, this shit's gonna explode. <laughs> Brutal. Okay, so it turns out gravity is a grave weakness for us. We cannot get too close. Footing is terrible. The lava bank is very slickery. So we're just gonna slip and slide on it whenever we go to it. We're just gonna stay away. We've learned our lesson to stay away. I'll get copper. Uh, I don't know if our quest is combined. Yeah, I'll get the coal. Okay, that's that was what I was gonna get at. If, if you try to get the coal, oh no, it's combined. It's for sure. It's I, it, it's giving me progress. Gotta find the parts to scavenge. I don't know where we're we gonna can. Find that. We'll find those parts. Don't you worry. Even though we just threw them in the lava. Adam, so you threw them in the lava. I did. I did no such thing. I did nothing of the sort. And apparently, they're impervious to lava. Because they are still alive and well in our in our backpacks. So do we have a HUD thing? No, we don't have a HUD thing for more parts. I suppose they're the only ones. That would be a very devastating situation if that is literally the only parts to progress our quest. And we threw them in the lava in 0.5 seconds after playing the game. Hilarious. But... I'm very unfortunate. Oh, I hear the rumbles in my tumbles. We got a rumbling in my tumbling. I feel like I'm gonna die. I feel like I'm gonna die too. Again. Hide from the eruption. But wh where do I hide? The ship. I refuse to go back to the ship until we have all of our parts. That might that might be a... Get inside. The volcano's about to... Oh, go get inside the submarine. It says quest is paused. Well then! Like, no, you can't stay out here. You can die. It is the danger zone. Well, can I... I can make it back. And try for lava again. Try to get our backpack. Uh, we'll have to try to do it after the world has been submerged in lava. Gary's down outside and watch it. I can, you know what? I'm kind of curious to do that. I'm not going to lie to you. I kind of am curious to, to like stay outside and see. I got a minute to make 400 meters. I think I could do it. I'm at 300 meters. Well, if anybody's gonna get Pompeyed up in this bee, it's me. All right, I want to kill you and slow you down. That's very toxic. You're a terrible partner. This is supposed to be co-op, not hinder your partner from progressing. Actually, that's pretty much a par for the course when it comes to nerd parade videos. Hey, I, I'm going to turn satisfactory into the same type of thing. <laughs> so, I'm guessing maybe the water is safe? Uh, it's, it's, tw I got 20 seconds. Things are looking grim for the old sure. Nick here. God, it's getting loud. It's, like the, it's actually drowning. Close the door behind, behind me. You're not getting in. You, oh, you suck. You closed the door. It's... I'm not gonna make it. It's so loud, it's kind of drowning you out. I'm gonna have to change the sound. One. Don't just be it. Okay, there it goes. I see you. <laughs> Run! I am Run. ready. You I'm can glad make it. I can make I'm it. Not the door yet. I'm glad it's, it's not like an instantaneous wipe. Oh, oh god! Oh my god, that's terrifying. Close the door, bye. <laughs> no, but no, oh yeah, I suffocated. I was there. Hey, I'm, I'm here. It's okay. This is purgatory. Like all survival games, this is hell. And we're doomed to repeat the same task over and over and over again until- Oh my god! It killed all the trees! Everything's covered in ash! Oh, our thing seems to have respawned. Oh, yay! Wait, so maybe a volcano eruption is a reset? Maybe. Yeah! Because we mined this already. Interesting. Very interesting. I like how it completely changed the atmosphere. Like it was nice and greenery, and now it is devastated. That's pretty cool. Oh, it, oh this, I think this stuff is in a random new spot, though. Is it? 
Did they? Yeah, they get moved. Did our lava pool get changed or altered by? Are there new lava pools? That appears that there might be a new one. No, that's yeah. No. Just much bigger looking. It does look much more intimidating now. Okay. Oh, you got the thing. Use submarine Allie. system for protection. Allie. I'll save you, Mary Jane. You don't need my help. These things have aimbot, I swear. Every single bullet they shoot always hits you. Well, that's they are robots. They do have, like, tactical... Did I pick up shotgun ammo? Interesting note for the future. Hello. We can get a shotgun. One of my favorite guns in all games. It's the sprayest of prayest. The shotgun. The shat gun. All right, I'm heading back. We're going to complete this quest if it's the last thing we do. I've died several times. I am not an effective geologist. But I'm going to redeem myself. I'm going to be an effective steampunker. On this... On the submarine vessel. <laughs> I can't wait. Did I just leave you in the dust? I'm right behind you. Oh, okay. I was going to say, you might have some stuff in your inventory that I have to use, but... Maybe it's combined inventory, not 100%. We're about to find out. Raw. Look at those pro jumping skills. All right, so. That's door. So that's just like an imp. That's just like an inventory thing. We'll shut that just in case. Oh wait, I got an achievement for shutting the door. It's called extra protection. Oh wait, no, you. <laughs> or did, was that because you activated the quest? Oh, it was automatically. I, oh. There's one. There's a whole bunch of different quests, which are some are pretty hilarious. Produce copper ingot. Did you already input the stuffs? I think. I don't know. So I, I got. Buttons. Nothing's happening though. Okay, there's co my copper scrap. Uh, let's put my copper ore in here. And we're gonna wait. Where did the where, where my stuff go? Researching something. I don't know what I'm hitting. Where did I just donate that copper to? There's a storage system somewhere. I know that. I don't remember how to access it. Oh, here's a storage right here. Is my stuff in it? Oh, hey, what are you? A bench replacement module for. Oh, interesting. We're gonna raid the captain's quarters. I don't know where I put the stuff. I'm not sure where you put it either. I, I moved it over to the other side. In this oh, panel. I copper again. I got my coal, but you put your copper somewhere. Oh, this is a display panel. Did you I, put have, I have no worldly idea what I'm doing. And I'm confident that I'm messing more up than anything else. I really don't know what I did with the copper. I put all the copper ingots in there. Or all the copper... Oh, maybe it's in here. I found it. <laughs> Where'd you put it? I found it. For whatever reason, it was in the top storage unit. Weird. That Yeah, weird. Okay, so let's go into you. We'll select... Can I do times five? We're just, I'm just pressing buttons. Made the intel thing. Okay, we have 20 copper ore. Copper ingot from copper ore. Oh, coal! I'm sorry. No wonder. Do you have coal on you? Uh, I tried to drop it. I don't know where it went. Oh, man. I still have two left. Let me look in the inventory. How much do you need? I put, I put two in here. Two? I put it not, in this cabinet over here. I'm not 100% sure. I think it's just maybe one. That's not the right cabinet. Down here. Down here. Oh, I see you. Oh, I see you. I see you. That's the sulfur cabinet. Okay, so two coal. It's the very confusing process to make. It's one copper, one coal. There you go. There we go. Walk to work table. Click menu. 
Click take items. Okay, oh, well, I was already here. Uh, give items to single player. You can use nearby chest. Required items, Intel production, TI-1, and copper ingot. We might have that. Do you have the TI-1? The same cabinet. There you go. Same cabinet. Okay. So you do have to combine, combine inventories. Okay, we got the TI-1. Quick menu button on work table. Select upgrade tab. You produce drill core one. Where's the freaking work table? Great. Is this a work table? Right here. I'm, look, I'm looking at it. There's an icon on oh, it. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, it tells me. Uh, drill ship core. Talk to the captain. Get shot by mine. Get pickaxed by mine. Don't pickaxe the captain. No. Leave the submarine. Wow, he just kicked us out like that? Yeah, he just kicked us out. Claim drill ship. Uh, cog drill ship is going to surface near our location. Use it to your advantage. Let us fuck. That's rude. Very rude. Ha! I made it out, sucker. <laughs> We're not too terribly far away. Oh, wait, is that in the lava pool? Uh, it's a slightly different direction. Is it? Okay. If we get to... Oh my god, the foliage is growing back. This is a magical place. This place is magical. The foliage grows back so quickly. Oh man, oh man that guy's big. And surrounded by GoBots. How dare you shoot him. Yeah, what's up? Get Rex. <gasps> we made a base. Like from home, we're fixing this. Holes in it. We did a thing! Good work! You are now captain of your own vessel. We made a base! We made it. There's a cot here. We made a sub base. I have no idea what to do in this new base that we've created, but we've done a thing. And this is where we're going to leave you for the first episode of Vulcanoids. Thank you guys so much for coming to hang with us here today. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm actually having some fun with it. Oh, there's a map here that tells us where to go. It doesn't look like Vulcanoids is like a massive world. It's, uh, what are you doing on the map? You're interacting with it. Oh, my drill ship. <laughs> Tunnels? I stand corrected. There's underground. There's more to this than meets the eye. Take that. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. I hope you're having some fun playing or enjoying Vulcanoids alongside of us. If you do, you know what to do for me. Hit the thumbs up button. Let us know that you like the stuff. Let us know that you got to laugh. And let us know that you're having fun. Oh, the Yipichi Loco. Oh, my, oh, that's beautiful. It's beautiful. I like it so much. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Also, ring the bell so you can stay up to date with all things Nerd Parade, all things that we're doing. Mine is trying. <laughs> you have alerted the ship's defenses. It does not like you doing the thing that you're doing. Take care of yourselves out there, guys. Stay awesome. And we'll get trolled by mine in the very near future. Later.